Hold on. OpenAI just did a dramatic U-turn. They're bringing back GPT-4.0, and it's all because users called the new GPT-5 cold. Stay till the end to discover why AI personality matters more than raw brains. Hey, everyone. Today we're unpacking why OpenAI reversed course and reinstated GPT-4.0 just a day after launching GPT-5. By the end, you'll know what triggered the backlash, how OpenAI responded, and what this means for the future of AI. If AI news is your thing, smash that subscribe button. Let's dive in. Let's start from the top. On August 7th, OpenAI launched GPT-5 as the default for all ChatGPT users, replacing GPT-4.0 and several older models with a unified system. GPT-5 is smarter, faster, and more accurate, but it also ditched the option to pick different models. Users were furious. Communities flooded Reddit and X, saying GPT-5 felt efficient but soulless, and one described losing GPT-4.0 as like killing a friend. A backlash so intense people even threatened to cancel their subscriptions. In response, CEO Sam Altman acknowledged they underestimated how much people loved GPT-4.0, and in under 24.0 Migrated's OpenAI announced GPT-4.0 would return, but only for ChatGPT Plus subscribers. Plus users also got double the GPT-5 usage limits, sweetening the deal. This turn of events highlights something powerful. In AI, personality matters. It's not just about capability, it's about connection. And it shows how agile OpenAI's approach is. Shipping early, listening fast, adapting quickly. And it paves the way for future AI that lets you pick the vibe. Friendly, nerdy, whatever fits your mood. So what do you think? Should AI come with selectable personalities, or is cold efficiency the future? Drop your thoughts in the comments, I'll be there, reading everyone. If you found this video helpful, hit that like button, share with fellow AI fans, and don't forget to subscribe for breaking AI news and deep dives.